More than 30 local beers to taste. Minnesota Beer Week is a great way to try some locally made brews. Yeah, and here to tell us all about it is Katie Hickman with Minnesota Monthly, the Beer Presenter of the Week. <laughs> yes. uh, this is the very first ever Beer Week. Uh, explain to us what exactly does that mean? Yeah, so Beer Week is May 7th through the 13th. You get a little beer coaster and it has all 31 participating locations on it. You go to that restaurant, they check you off, and you either get a complimentary beer or a flight of beer. Oh, amazing. Okay. And that's it, you know, you go where you want to go. 31 yeah. different beers, $25. The beer scene, phenomenal on the Twin Cities. What do you it think is. makes it so good? I think, especially lately, we've seen so many Minnesota made beer. We see yeah. all of these breweries popping up. Uh, which is so, it's awesome. You know, we have patio season here and we love to support local Minnesota. So mm -hmm. it's awesome to see. Uh, what'd you bring? You have a whole bunch of stuff <laughs> here did. to talk about. And this one caught my eye right away, a little mango. Yes, so this is from Liftbridge. <laughs> I love, I love me some water. mango. Do you, I, I do. <laughs> I just learned something just new about Brian today. To the mango. Okay. Yeah, yep. and this has a nice subtle mango taste. So it's not like super fruity and overpowering. You still kind of get that golden oat taste to it. Sure. Um, and this is one of their seasonal summer beers. Where's so this one from? Liftbridge. Liftbridge. Still water. Yep. Correct. Yes, yeah, I believe still that's water. Yeah, it's still water. Moving along here, what do we have? So this is from Great Waters. This is their Hall & Oats. They're located mm -hmm. in St. Paul. I see what you're doing there. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's super low bitterness. It has a little bit of that fruity taste to it, um, but again, it has that ni nice, rich, oaty kind mm -hmm. of multi. -taste. I always love coming up with adjectives to describe things: oaky and mango and oaty and, 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 and this last one here is an here? IPA. Yeah. So if we continue across the Twin Cities into Shakopee, this is Badger Hill, um, and this one is their IPA Trader. So they say it's a little bit. West Coast IPA and a little bit not. Oh, so, okay. okay. It has four different hops in it, um, so it definitely has a very distinctive taste. Um, so if you like IPAs, this might be a nice one to try because it's a little bit different than your kind of traditional sure. IPA. A great way to try maybe some of the places that you've been meaning to get right. to, probably haven't, you know, just got, maybe you haven't thought to go all the way to right. a different side of town. And we have, um, at minnesotabeerweek.com, we have an interactive map that shows you where all, they, all the locations are. It's restaurants um, and breweries. So you can kind of say, maybe this day we're going to tackle the east side, this side, the west side, um, yeah. plan it out so plan you can hit your them attack. all. <laughs> yes. So it's May 7th through the 13th, over yes. 30 participating locations. You get a complimentary beer at each one, $25 for a ticket. $25. And you can buy them up through the 4th, up which is what, tomorrow. tomorrow. Okay, okay, so you got to act fast here, kind gotta of. Got to get on that. Yes. Um, <laughs> awesome. Yeah, they'll Thank also you. be at Grill Fest, so if you're there, you can snag a ticket, but okay. otherwise we'll... We're looking forward to a good week. Drink Thank beer you, and eat. Katie. Yeah. It goes hand we've in hand. We've got all we the details it. about Minnesota Monthly Beer Week at care11.com on our 4 p.m. page. We will be right back. Good job.